Okay. Let's do alert this time. So for comparison, this is the Generation 1 Red Alert. This is actually a original. This is not a reissue. There's, you can see there's a little bit of paint chipping here. But otherwise, it is in pretty good shape. You know how you transform this, pull the legs back, separate them, flip the feet down, pull the arms out, flip that down, head is kind of stuck right now for some reason. And there we go. It comes up a little bit. There. This is, that is Generation 1 Alert. It comes with a shoulder mounted missile. missile. Goes like that. Missile and a gun which you can hold in his hand, but <laughs> it's being a little finicky right now. So that's generation one red alert. This is the oops masterpiece masterpiece edition. I have not opened this one yet. I do have the Lambor slash Sideswipe, as you can see in my previous video, but I have that one to work. This guy, essentially the same transformation, so I'm not going to go over it. Now one thing I have noticed from being at a toy store, I'm picking up one of these from my friend earlier, some of the, at least one of these has this light rack missing. So if you get one of these, check to make sure that it has the light rack. So I'll show you what comes in here. You have alert. These appear to be some piece for its head. Now, this is a one thing that's different from Lambor. Lambor has two pounders that show that are in one episode and that they you can attach it in place of its hands. This, I believe, fits over the head. I can't remember exactly what episode that's from, but uh, I wonder if it's a Crimson episode. Anyway, I'm not going to use those. So here's the alert. Autobot symbol up front. Tiny, tiny Lamborghini symbol, which compared to the size on this one. Well, this one doesn't actually have the Lamborghini symbol. Go figure. All right. So now I have to remember how to transform this. And I will admit, I had to look at the instructions to figure out how to transform Lambor. So, Call. Uh, oh yeah. Let's go down first. That. Then gently, gently. There we go. That folds down. The arms fold out. After I figured, after I looked at that part, I was able to do the rest without the instructions. That folds up, folds down, folds, actually it stays out. Arms come out of there. Hands, I mean. Folds around. Folds out. Interesting, they actually have to fold the top of the head down. 
in order to, for it to fit. Now the legs were kind of weird. Folds up. And then these parts fold in. It will take a little bit of force, not too much. Fold that down, that down. I'm doing some things out of order. Unclip the feet from the back. That part folds around, that folds down. And folds up. This part rotates. I'm just trying to remember how. Rotates down like that. And now this, there's actually a little panel here that comes out. Fits into a little slot there, so you fold that around like that. There's a little tab here that allows you to line everything up. So the tab goes into that slot. The rear bumper fo forms kind of like a, let's call that an ankle guard, I guess. So that's one leg. The other leg is done. The same way. Oh yeah, I forgot to get the forgot to get this panel out. spur comes out. Now, a little bit of a tricky part with the waist. That folds down to form his groin, for lack of a better term. And then this entire waist folds back and then forward until it clicks. Then this part, there's a little slot that probably you can't see right there. Fits onto a little tab that you might be just be able to make out there. If I can get this lined up. I don't want to force it. There we go. Now the windows fold back. Kind of like this so that they're out of the way. And maybe fold those back and back. So click everything else into place. And there you go. And again, compared to the original, blackhead, ver blackhead versus redhead. A very nice model, very poseable. Again, yeah, the two. Hey, that's one way to get them out of the plastic, isn't it? Lift it up so that they fall right out. This, there's a little hole right here. I'm putting, probably putting this on the wrong shoulder. I don't care. It will fit in either. I think. Just like that. And it goes here. There's a little slot. Maybe you can just make it out there. That fits in a similar size slot on his hand. Like that. So that is Masterpiece Alert and one more piece of my Transformers collection. Peace.